is Jesus Manuel Menegarza. I hope you're having a fantastic day. I'm at Explore USA RV Supercenter in Fort Worth, Texas. And let's take a peek at this uh, twin bed model for the Flag Flagstaff Microlight Series for 2020. It's going to be a quick tour. The other twin 30 pounders here in an area right here where they put your uh, plug. You could put two batteries right there. <coughs> There's the jacks. Get some pass-through storage. Unusually shaped pass-through storage, but it's pass-through storage nonetheless. Has magnetic door holders. Good size and strong slide there. You have the storage right down here. That goes way up there. Way up there. Put your fishing poles up there. Oop, let's go down. Went a little too far. Sorry about that. Yeah, storage right here behind the uh, little sofa. The dinette sofa. And of course it comes with this uh, little table here, a metal table. And of course the little uh, outdoor cooktop. There's the dumps, the tires, your Castle Rock ST tires. Your tank flush. Your antenna connections. City water connection, antifreeze inlet. This is where you connect your 30 amp. Got a little ladder to go to the roof. And of course, there's the back of the refrigerator and the back of the water heater, outdoor shower. You got your spare tire here. That's where you can put your stinky slinky. Here's a view from this side. It's going to be, again, a rather uh, quick tour. This is where you connect that uh, place, your outdoor table, and your little stove top right there, your little outdoor table and stove top right there. That's your exhaust for the stove, so don't get too close to that. Make sure the children don't play near that. Of course, you have uh, Torflex suspension. Very nice. Radial tires with nitro fill. And they got the new uh, truck system technologies. Tire pressure monitors. It's another uh, spot here for the uh, antenna. For your uh, TV, you connect your TV right there and you got your plugs and a little mount up here, okay? The steps to get in, those are nice steps. Those are very nice steps. Here's your storage. Let's see what's back here. Maybe we'll find a surprise. Again, that's that pass-through storage. You have two areas to access it. Pretty solid, you got your magnetic uh, holebacks. Nice, nice, super size awning. Jealousy awning style uh, windows. Dark tint. Let's go inside. This is a good size handle. I like that when the door stays in place and doesn't slam me. Got your step above uh, entry system. One thing I like about these is that they're upgraded. Let me close this a little bit. There we go. They're upgraded, so they actually uh, will stay in place. Some of the models, uh, you actually have to have some uh, strength to lower them and raise them. So this one actually has some pistons. Again, that's, these doors are supposed to stay in place, but it's so windy here. 
storage right there your controls various controls right there your fuse box right there solid surface countertops with an extension stainless steel uh, sink with covers got your three burner stove top bifold very nice and of course uh, your suburban stove so you have a suburban stove oven I mean rather oven or stove whatever you want to call it let's call it oven and stove top okay and of course this uh, extends your surface area for you to work you have the extension leaf right there all the way down here there's your microwave there's your IRV Technologies uh, audio system. Very nice quality audio system. And a good size TV. And let me sit on this, um, the dinette and see how, that's a good spot. I can sit here and watch the tube. Has a sound bar right under it. Let's take a peek at that close up. So you have a sound bar and you have controls in the back. Yeah, this is a nice little TV. This unit has been wired for solar. This is your controls for your uh, heat and air conditioning. Let's go in the restroom. Typically, the restroom is the brightest room in the RV. So you have storage down there. Sometimes it's just blocked off. Let's take a peek. No, that's not too bad. It goes back a little ways. Sometimes you only get like an inch of storage. You have the plastic sink control, a little bath, uh, towel ring, and some ugly guy right there with a the camera, and an area there for your cup, your tooth brushes, and this opens up very nicely. And of course, this has a shower miser system, nice and bright in here, I like that. Photographers like it when you gotta have light. When it's dark, it's not good. So this is the AquaView shower miser system safety water safety water and that's your storage back here you get a whole one two three levels of storage and way up here you have your uh, max air fan with max air cover and of course these are vents that open up and you have lights that you can turn on or turn off when you have electricity this is not plugged in So let's pan down and there's our refrigerator our refrigerator it's an eight cubic foot refrigerator not a six cubic foot an eight cubic foot refrigerator and right next to it let me open that up this is a, a propane and electric refrigerator and there it is opened up for your viewing pleasure let me open up the top too might as well since i'm here and there you go let me close it now there's one there's two. Oh, didn't close very well. Has the nice little wood covers, panels, and this is a nice little pantry or a closet. It's up to you. Super dark in there. Whoa, you can't see anything. One, two, three, four areas where you can store stuff. And then you got some storage way down there and some AC receptacles. You have some storage. Oh, you can open there and storage. You can open there. You can open on this one. There you go. Nice storage. Plywood box, construction, solid wood fronts, all metal glides. Can't complain about that. Good thick uh, materials. Nice looking table. I like that table. What do you think of that table? Nice table. Get one, two windows, plenty of light, and of course you have storage up here also. Let me open that up, show you up here. Yep, storage right there. And it goes all the way across. And then you have storage down here. More storage. Plenty of storage. A lot of storage. 
magnificent storage. Look at that. Hey, you got some light over here. As compared to the other closet, didn't have any light. <laughs> this action camera is horrible in, you know, under uh, when there's not enough light. Does not like dark cabinetry. Does not like dark storage. And this is what makes this unit very different. And of course they should fire the maid because the maid did not clean up the room. This should be nicely organized with a mint on the bed, okay? But they didn't do that. So there's the uh, bed. Got one bed there, one bed there, and you got these that you can fill in the space with. Yes, yeah, some receptacles down there. Some receptacles, AC receptacles, USB receptacles, also 12 volt. You got pleated uh, window covers. Nice storage up here. Goes all the way across. Very nice. Let me take a pan here. Good size windows. You got a big window here. You got a big window there. You got a big window there. Plenty of light. But today it's an overcast day in Fort Worth. And uh, it's not very nice. Not very nice. Hopefully your travels go, you go to, when you travel, you go to nice places and have a lot of fun in the sun. It's not too rainy, it's not too much uh, snow, etc. etc. Got some storage under this bed, and that's it. Let me, let me get out of here. And uh, thank you very much for watching my video. Sorry for all the insane camera movements. Again, this is the Flagstaff. 22 TBS. Flagstaff 22 TBS. If you have any questions, contact the folks at Explore USA RV Super Center in Fort Worth, Texas, or wherever your, your local Flagstaff or uh, comparable Rockwood dealership. Of course, there's always Rockwood versions of Flagstaff products. They basically come off the same assembly line. My name is Jesus Manuel Menegarza. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share i would greatly greatly appreciate it thank you very much ahead of time and don't forget to leave your kind and friendly comments below the description those are greatly appreciated from fort worth texas this has been jesus manuel menegarza with his little jiggly uh gimbal and camera gracias adios bye bye Thank you.